Hi friends, Allison here with AJ's Inspired Life and I wanted to do a quick video for you because I got some mail um, as I'm filming today is Sunday so I actually got it last night um, but I have not been able to um, break it open and I thought oh as I'm doing that I'm gonna do it with you so you can see I'm already in my jammies if you can see those I have my teacup flannel jammies on anyway so um, I wanted to show you I <laughs> Last week or last couple weeks, you guys saw that I got this beauty, right? My first kind of higher end, not highest, I know, but um, watercolor set, but I actually got it for the size. And so I've been watching a lot of your videos and just loving them. And I thought I'm going to make a little travel case. So I put it in this little bag that I had. I think it's actually for makeup, probably uh, a little makeup bag. But anyway, I put it in there, and so um, I've been able to kind of take it with me. So I have this one, but look what I got yesterday. It's my second one. And so this one is the neutral. Okay, and I thought, you can tell, um, I already took off all the little wrappings, and I've unwrapped them. And I was just about to swatch it, and I thought, gosh, I'm just going to do that with you really quickly so you guys can see the colors as they you know they come so this is exactly how it came look at the fun artwork isn't she pretty and then it comes with this fun little you know swatch card I would call it I guess and then those are the cards or the each color so as you can see I already unwrapped them I put them in the order that they were in they already come in an order and I know a lot of you custom order paints and make your own little tins and all that and I'm just not there yet. So this is the Neutral Palette by Jane Davenport and I just thought I would swatch it for you real quickly. So I just have my little fillable brush that's not filled. I actually dabbed it, you can see, and I, before I turned on the camera. So this color is Mango. And I don't know if you can see. This one's called Apple. Now this one is a true apple. Isn't that pretty? I was kind of sad because last time, I think I shared with you guys, this is the Brights. And this color right here is called Ladybug. And it wasn't quite quite as red as I had wanted it. Um, it's very pretty. I just, when I think of Ladybug, I think of red, red. And that that's a red, red. But it is actually a little orange, isn't it? I don't know if you can see that, but it's still really, really pretty. So, all right, we'll just do this quickly. Blueberry. They're obviously kind of um, easy to tell what color is what. So, this is Dove. And I don't know if there's like proper etiquette or something for swatching, like. I just smudged that a little bit, but I'm okay with it. That's really pretty. This one's Unicorn. I haven't seen this. I don't know if it's just white or if it has like a, like any iridescent or something to it. I don't, I can't really see any. I think it's just white. I think it's just white and I don't have, um, Gosh, I have a blue sticky here. We could try it on that. Let's see if I have a color. Here's a blue sticky. Yeah, just white. Very cool though. All right, the next one's Raven, which is obviously the black. That's kind of cool. And then, well, I'll show you what is in the other set just to compare. We go down to the bottom, vitamin C. I love the names. That's pretty. The next one is sand, which is one of my favorite things because it is usually found on a beach. Well, you know, or in, in my car after the beach, right? So that to me is not as, um, well, we'll see when it dries. Can you see that? That's pretty yellow to me. That's not maybe what I would actually call sand, so that's interesting. This one, please excuse the noise in the background. We have music and laundry. 
I hope you guys can't hear all that. Buff. Which is a little orangey also. Oh, spice. I bet you this one's going to be beautiful. Look at that. That one's really pretty, you guys. Oh, I really like that one. Okay. And then the next one is called Kiss Kiss. I think it'd be fun to come up with the names. Kiss Kiss. I don't know why they call that Kiss Kiss. If any of you know, please let me know. Is that like supposed to be a lipstick color or... I was thinking like if it was Kiss, I don't know if that's... Can you see it? It's pretty orangey. Pretty orangey. All right, and then the last one is called Coco, which should be kind of like a hot chocolate, if you will. But again, I'm not a color person or an art background or anything. Um, I would say this is an orange brown, though. It's not as dark as maybe some cocoa, I would say. Now, I just did a really, really light testing of these. You guys can see you'd have to add, you know, more to some of these. Look at how bright the red is. I love it. Okay, so that's the neutral palette, and I'll show you really quickly in comparison. Those are the brights. Oops, and I have one out of order or something here, so yikes. I'll have to figure out. <laughs> It goes right, where does it go, you guys? It must go in here. I don't know, I'll have to figure it out. It's out of order. Um, but those are the colors. So you can see you do get different colors if you buy the two sets. Let me get you in frame here, oops. If you buy the two sets. So, and I know a lot of you, you know, intermix. So if I'm gonna just take one tin with me, I'll just choose kind of the color palettes or the colors I want for the day. And I'll have to figure out where this one goes. So um, I'm hoping it goes I don't know. We'll, we'll have to test it out. So anyway, that's it, you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me. It was just a quick one tonight, but I wanted to show you. I was super excited. So I'm excited to be able to take a little bit of artwork with me as I travel through the day or whatnot and take a little break. And um, I'm about to work on my Fobo. And I already have my sticker picked out for today because I have this cute little set. And it has a little watercolor palette on it. So I'm going to sample these on my page, and then I'm going to use the sticker. So... Uh, that will be part of what I journal about today. So thanks for hanging out me with me. Thanks for hanging out with me, you guys. And uh, I hope you find something that inspires you today. Have a great day. Bye.